Hello everybody and welcome back to Jurassic World the game. About maybe a month or so after the um, previous one. You already know who I am, so there, there's no need for an introduction. Before we even begin the video, if you guys if you guys just wanna help, you know, subscribe, like, comment, any, everything helps, you know. So yeah. What I'm making this video about is just basically how this game has really just gone downhill, honestly. It's become extremely pay to win. Like if, like, I mean, I I hacked the game. I'm sorry. I I couldn't, I couldn't deal with Ludia's bullcrap. Like, the um, the like insane amount of things that like you need for this game. It's ridiculous. Like if we switch that upside down, look at the amount of DNA you're gonna need to purchase a Udon. That's seventy-eight thousand. Yeah, that's seventy-eight thousand. If you wanted to have a Udon. The Mega Archelon, 68,000. The low, the lowest one of those hybrids is Gorgas Uchis, and even then it's 42,000 DNA, which makes it basically impossible to level up. Every last one of these hybrids are like insanely, like have insane costs. The, the cheapest hybrid, super hybrid, is like right there, Spider Raptor. Like, I think Ludi is just going a little bit too crazy with this game. And this, who in their right mind would pay $30 for a Dimorphodon? Something that you could unlock just by doing battles. It makes no sense. Like, that's pay to win. Year two, you, you have a, ch a chance, not a guarantee, a chance of getting Uudon. Even then, you have a higher chances of getting Megatherium or Marsupial Lion. Even then, like, it's, it's, not, it's not good. And for that, they're charging $50. For another $30, the Century Pack for already fused hybrids, Dunklosaurus, and Dominus Rex. And even though, even then, you're probably going to get Parasaur. For, let's go to the normal hybrid, the normal um, things. That, that, right there, the Century Pack. Why does Ludia think that's necessary? It doesn't even have good dinosaurs that really that good dinosaurs in it. The only good dinosaurs that are in here, excuse me, are Metrophodon, Indoraptor, and Indominus Rex. Pachygosaurus, it's good, but it's tack. I don't really like it too much. But like, why does why does what do you think that's something that they should do? Nobody buys these packs. Nobody buys them. Even the VIP has basically become useless you have to pay for bucks to get them now which is really not not it's like it's not something you want to do the best value most popular twenty thousand do you know how fast i can go through twenty thousand bucks just by leveling up one creature by leveling up one tournament creature if i was level a tournament creature matter of fact just by leveling up one hybrid like like let, for instance let's go in let's put a dunklosaurus in Put a Dunklosaurus in for it being the one of the the most expensive hybrids. Let's put Dunklosaurus in there. One thousand six hundred eighty freaking bucks to speed up. Really? That doesn't make any sense. It it doesn't. No matter what way you look at it, it makes no sense. You might argue, well, it's 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 like it's worth it because of the um. Because of it. no, there's no way this thing is worth it. Like, it's it's worth it just to wait for it. Honestly, it's like, why is this one not making any sounds? <laughs> Even then, like, it's they've come become made to money hungry. I don't even bother with Code Red anymore. I've, I've tried my best. There's, ever since that update with it, I still cannot figure out how the hell to freaking... But I mean, what is interesting to see is the, their animations when they attack the fence. Like that, that's pretty cool. Um, why does the freaking music keep on cutting off? All right, now here's, here's where the, my problem really is. The battles. Battle stage infinite. That's understandable. Let me fix the audio real quick. Hold on. Like, I missed this game back 
Sorry, I, you know, I had to undo that. Um, screw it. Prognathodon, I, I, really, I really don't like Prognathodon. I mean, it's it's cool. It's a too cool dinosaur, I guess. I mean, the only reason you would even want Prognathodon at this point, unless you're just starting the game, the only reason you would want Prognathodon at this point would be to get its hybrid, which is Xenathodon. Which I'm actually surprised I remembered that. So it's Factinus and um, Prognathodon. Prognathodon. There we go, silver prize. We gotta get anything new out of this. I, well, I actually have all the super rares now that I think about it. So there really is nothing new for me to get out of this. It's, and then for that, the mammoth, like, all of these are so not worth it. Guys, if you don't have, like, resources like I do, don't waste your time on these. They're, it, they're not worth it. You have a 1% chance of getting the top prize. Even then, you're just, you're trading an insane amount of bucks for DNA. That's, that's not something you should do. It's, it really isn't. So now, here we go. Like, look, where the hell is the audio? For crying out loud. Oh my god. For crying out loud, where the hell is the audio to this thing? Like, if I turn the music off, and the sound effects off, turn it back on, turn that back on. Yeah, okay, fine. Alright, um, like this. For the Dino Bucks pack. For Super Rares. Really? Three Spinal Tosukuses? Are you serious? And now, on top of that, we don't have any, there are no, if you guys never noticed, the Super Rares got no love when it came to aquatic, I mean, um, amphibian hybrids. There's no amphibian hybrids to counter this thing. So basically, what you need to do is basically just go in with the best things you possibly can. Even then, those won't cut it. So Spino Raptor, Supreme Titan, and my own Spino Tosukus. That's the best thing I can think to go up against. Because most of the strong things that we have that aren't th these three are herbivores. We only have one, one pterosaur super hybrid, if I'm not mistaken, honestly. And I just got to say, that thing does look pretty badass, I'm not going to lie. It's, it's teeth cut. It actually looks a lot scarier in this game. Oh my god, I've never actually versed. This thing looks a lot scarier in this game. It really does. Oh my god. Wow, this thing is scary. But, like, this game, is, it's just gone downhill with the insane, the insaneness of the battles. Like, like, why, why? I think Ludi's just going a little bit too far with the, um, with the little thing where the, the boosted, the boosted opponent. Like, now it's gotten to the point where you can't even use dinosaurs. It really makes no sense to have anything that is below Indominus Rex. Because you can't use it. Unless you're doing normal battles. And half of the time, these aren't normal battles. So, like, as to why Ludia thinks that this is so much better than what this game used to be, it isn't. Honestly, I want I would take it out of it. I if I was if I worked for Ludia which I wish I did. But if I worked for Ludia, I would take this out of the game. I would take the overpowered things out of the game and just give the normal creatures that you verse. So you can actually use your actual creatures. Because, like, my level now, I can't tell you how much I would love to use Soprano Titan up, up against normal battles, but I can't unless it's a tournament or something like that. Like, it's, it's ridiculous. Can you kill? Ooh, you know what? He maybe probably can. Yeah, I think he probably can kill me. I mean, look, like, look at that. Two, six thousand damage. Dude, come on. Like three spinal circuses, really? And another thing I've noticed: some of the battles where it would be one or two battles, it would, it's now three. Or not, some of the battles where it would be three battles, and then you would get a pack. It's now five. So now you have to pick and choose 
extremely wisely who you want to put it in and if that it's even going to work. Like, I'm going to show you guys what I mean in a minute. Like, it's, it's really just disgusting, honestly. Like, I used to love this game. Like, I praised this game. I loved it. The hybrids, the hybrids are gorgeous. They look great. But just gameplay-wise, it's gotten so crap. Like, Herbivore Challenge. Let's check out what the Herbivore Challenge is. Only three herbivores for the herbivore pack showcasing the Parasaurus on the front. And the best thing you could probably get out of this is Shonosaurus or, or the Therizinosaurus. Lowest thing you could possibly get out of it is a common. No, it's it's the Zootoceratops. Which nobody wants a new Zootoceratops. All you really can get from that is a packy Ceratops. And even then, he's not really that good. But look at this. Really? Really? Why? I would have to bring second Sutras in here. But you know what? We're going to entertain the game. We're actually going to try this with lower level creatures. It's just that I've gotten to that point where I don't even... I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to win it or not. Which is why I've refrained from even doing the battles sometimes. Going to go Potosaurus because of his life. Going to go Stiggy Moloch. And I, wa I don't want to put Saganus Switches in. I really don't. Oh, man. And Monostagatops, Mono I guess. It's just, I, I don't I don't like how, where this game has come. Like, how, like, yeah, this game has come so far. And yeah, it's releasing new creatures every so often. But, like, what's the point of even releasing new creatures if you can't even really use them? And why is it now become a thing where, in a card packs, your opponent goes first? Th that's not, that should not be a thing. That, even, that gives you more of a reason to not want to even do the battle. Like, me personally, I don't want to do the battle for the, after that. That's ridiculous. And look at that. It has more damage than the Potosaurus. Eh? Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, imagine if like if I'm, I was versing a Metrophodon right now. Three Metrophodons. Like, that would be so much better than this. Because this is ridiculous. Goes for another two hits. Um... We're gonna save save it for Stiggy Moloch. We're gonna go just go for this. Land two two hits on it. Like like right now, I'm not even sure if I'm gonna win this. And the, and like and like you don't even want to do the battles anymore because the prizes now are just this, this completely garbage. You ha no longer, I mean no longer, are able to get bucks out of any pack at all. Unless it is the Dino Bucks pack, and the he's not dead. Why isn't he dead? Oh crap! I didn't factor in the block. I didn't factor in the block. Um, uh, unless the Dino Bucks pack or the or or tournament pack. If it's not one of those, you're not getting bucks. Or a VIP pack, which is even more pay to win. Because then you're going to have to become a VIP. Unless you just so happen to run across 10,000. 10,000, you know. But, like, it's it's gotten to the point where it's just freaking ridiculous. Like, yeah, we killed him here. Cool. Like, these are the only types of battles where you'll actually be able to use lower level creatures. Because even when they're nerfed, they're just so freaking strong. And Stiggy Moloch, he's just adorable. Um, now here, we can just go for that. And Mono Stegatops, you know what I think? I think they kind of screwed Mono Stegatops over. Because in Jurassic World, the game, well, now, in Jurassic World Alive, now, Mono Stegatops is virtually useless. It is very, very underpowered. Yeah, uh, I had to finish my sentence. Um, because it cut off on me. But we're just gonna, like, you know, just make, add a little bit onto here. But, like, with Monos, like, Monostegatops, he used to be so good. Like, I used to be, like, getting taken down by every Monostegatops ever with, um, when I was using my Indominus Rex. And it, it was, 
it was pain like it was painful of course getting taken down by something all the freaking time but um like it's Jurassic Court Alive is slowly slowly might be getting heading down to the ground but it still is pretty good but this game I, I don't even think it's, it's going to go back up. Why is it going first again? Again, why are they going first? Why do... Well, I get that Moody is trying to make it a little more challenging, but not everybody wants to get challenged like this all the time. Like, this is ridiculous. And now I'm dead. Already, I'm dead. Right, yeah, we can kill him in two hits. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, like, Monostegatops has been nerfed. Spinatosuchus, they, they purposely, in this game, made him amazing. Gave him over 2,000 attack, everything. Oh, look at that. I have to use Segnosuchus for this, like... Like, yeah, I, I, I guess you can say if, you know what it is? If Ludia didn't take out the one of the probably the best things that were in this game, the, the thing where you can cancel out and then come back in, then this would be so much better. Because back when you can see what they're going to do, you can go go out and then come back in. Now, that doesn't work anymore. Just another thing that Ludia has basically shot themselves in the foot with doing. But that, this video was just basically just say, saying what I think, you know, has really happened with this game. I think I'm actually going to stop playing Jurassic World, the game, and just go, come more towards Jurassic World Alive, Mortal Kombat, and the Mario Kart Tour, like I said I was going to do. Because, like, look. Look at this. If you go in here, it's not, if you look at that, it's not even an option to get bucks anymore. You cannot get bucks at all. An Antarctic Adventure Pack? You probably can. Yes, there we go. And even then, it's only 500 bucks. Cenozoic Battle Pack. No bucks. The Dino Bucks Pack? That, that's disgusting. Like, really? So basically, all you're getting is 120 bucks out of this. What is anybody going to do with that? Nothing. Nothing. But leave it down in the comments. Do you guys agree with what I'm what I'm what I think? Cuz I honestly hate this. I, I I honestly don't even think I want to play this game anymore. It's gotten so disgusting and so bad. But if you guys agree with me, you know, just leave a like, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe. Comment what did you guys think has happened with this game that nobody really likes it anymore. My biggest thing is just it's just too pay to win. It really is. And I just can't do it anymore. So this might be one of the last videos I'm doing on this channel for this. Unless, of course, maybe a new boss comes out. Then that's opportunities for views. So, you know. But, you know. Yeah, that's it. So if you guys did enjoy it, leave a like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a good one.